Hi everyone, it's Pogdan Sada here, and welcome back to our educational video series. And today we walk into how to use Pogdan Web, one of the most advanced decentralized exchanges for the Pogdan network. Let's check it out. At a glance, do you think Pogdan Web is just Dex? Not really. Pogdan Web is cross-chain exchange on the mission to become the decentralized exchange for the interrupt future. Of course, it's possible thanks to substrate technology. The cross-chain interaction is truly an important factor in the future, where all the chains ecosystems of decentralized applications are built on top of it. They must connect with each other to deliver the smoothest, the most efficient, the most affordable cheap fee, the fastest and safest trading experience for users in crypto space to bring mass adoption. So how can PokerSwap be one of the pioneers in bringing DApps that can help drive our industry to mass adoption earlier? Let's find out, and the answer is right below. Firstly, PokerSwap removes trusted intermediaries and provides the opportunity for faster trading, which embraces the key advantages of blockchain. Not just that, PokerSwap offers a shared economy with its native token by staking other outstanding services like the bridge and unlimited benefits for users. Moreover, PokerSwap is a community project and devs collaborate on the open source code using the BSD4 clause license. So, in other words, PokerSwap has no certain limit because they can eventually add more features and technologies based on the open source code. One crucial part that is worth mentioning is that PokerSwap is powered by Sora. Sora is building to deliver financial inclusion for all without discrimination and provide a better method to manage day-to-day -day finances. One more thing that really shocks us when exploring Pocus Web is the fact that Sora has many super reliable partners such as Cambodia government, well-known Japanese business globally like Honda, Panasonic, and Sony investment arm, Sony Finance Holdings. Not to miss another big thing about Sora is this enormous roadmap plan as we can see right here. Alright, firstly we get access to the Pokeswap data website and look for the connect account button. Click on it. After being redirected to new screen is displayed here, please carefully check the URL link if it is like this or not to prevent phishing attacks. Then we press connect account to continue. Just in case we don't have one yet, we can create a new wallet using any of the product wallets out there like Phyllis Wallet, Sub Wallet, Polkadot Chagas Wallet, and yeah, Talisman. We've already had a video support you guys in creating your own Polkadot Wallet, and the link is in the description. In this video, we'll use Phyllis Wallet because it's a part of the server ecosystem, so it will be the most suitable and compatible for Polkadot Swap's decks. Now we'll be asked to add Phyllis Wallet from the Chrome extension and then we must pin it for later convenient purposes. And then we should create a new or import our existing wallet. Great, we have successfully connected our wallet to PokerSwap. Be sure to connect our wallet with the Sora Mainnet network to be able to use PokerSwap and anything from tokens should send to Sora Mainnet to our connecting wallet. And we are good to go. Now let's move on to next step. Okay, let's dive in and start with the swap function. There will be three main options for these features. First, the swap section. We can exchange between so many tokens supported in the Sora network, including stable coins, wrap tokens from a network that bridge from the IBC bridge, and native token of Sora mainnet, which is Sora token and PSwap token. Where Sora will be the platform token used to pay fee, and a PSwap is a reward token. We can be flexible to adjust limit rate as we wish in the settings. Enter the amount of tokens and choose the token we want to receive in just one simple click. Then we just need to submit and approve by our wallet. One of the most impressive features relating to swap section on PokerSwap is that comparing with normal AML model will cause a price impact as limited tokens when swapping are too high and we can experience a permanent loss due to this. However, with PokerSwap, it works like an aggregator when combining liquidity from many sources on different chains and projects which can be AMM pools, order books that in return can help users with smart swap rules to have in-depth liquidity for swapping tokens with low slippage and not to experience heavy impermanent loss. Within the pool section, we can choose to provide liquidity and earn profits in PSwap tokens. 
we might be curious if the PSWAP token is mainly used for rewarding liquidity provider, then the price of PSWAP token will eventually go down. So what is the motivation for the liquidity provider? Pretty, pretty simple. Apple receive rewards in the form of PSWAP and a part of protocol fee which is usually around 0.3% of the transaction fee will be used to buy back the PSWAP and burn PSWAP to reduce fixed supply gradually. This means that LPs will receive PSWAP token that potentially to have the increase in value. Sora and PokerSwap have created an economic sharing model that can bring a win-win relationship to all stakeholders. In order to provide a most flexible user fund, PokerSwap offers users to add or remove liquidity very smoothly and easily. On the staking section, PokerSwap enables us to stake any supported token to earn an annual percentage yield. It provides a calculator to help us find out the best staking solutions and return investment ratio for each solutions in terms of day, week, or even month according to our desired risk averse. Please note that at this stage, if we are not fully digit, then we highly recommend you users to try with a small money first to learn more about the game and continue depositing to earn more if we can manage our risk and rewards ratio. Next up is the bridge section, or in PokerSwap can call the Hashi Bridge. It's a bridge created by Sora to support transporting assets cross-chain from Ethereum network to Sora mainnet where PokerSwap is located. The reason why this bridge is so important is because the money flow and most DeFi total value locks have been a long time dominated by Ethereum DApp projects, therefore it's super crucial to partly create a chance like Hashi Bridge for crypto region or DeFi users to move from Ethereum where the gas fee is high to come to Sora Network and particularly PokerSwap where the fee is more affordable for daily users. The last feature of PokerSwap is the Explorer section where a diversity of services like farming, staking, providing liquidity to token explorations appear. Despite the last features, however, as we mentioned above, PokerSwap is built on an open source code base, therefore the potential for PokerSwap to build more products is limitless. As we researched and joined one of the core team AMA, they disclosed that PokerSwap is soon to expand to a wider range of services to best serve the customers and lending product might be part of it. And yeah, that's the video about to use PokerSwap, the most advanced and leading DEX on Sora Network. If you enjoyed the video, do not forget to like, share, subscribe to Pokemon Insider for more insightful videos. Bye, see you next time.